Today will be the end of a personal saga. Four months ago, I uploaded a video on this game called just Strays. He was a character I was waiting for to pull for months, and today is a similar day. I'll introduce you to Spectre Tenebria, my future wife. Now, this character is considered by many at the top as the or one of the best units in the game, and she is given completely for free for anyone that starts the game. You can pick an option of select a five star Moonlight heroes, which are these characters right here. I don't have these ones, for example. They're very exclusive, very expensive, very hard to get. And you have a choice between a few, and I made a mistake. Instead of going for waifu, I went for husbando, and guess what? I realized later in the game, Arbiter Vildred kind of sucks. He's really cool. Really cool. Guess what? He sucks. So today, I will finally be able to get the best unit in the game and my wife. Because although months and months and months after I've been wanting her, months, she hasn't really returned, but they made they brought back a banner that lets you choose whoever you want to summon for, and don't <laughs> don't think this is a nice thing. These summons are very expensive. God, this game is expensive. We're gonna be hoping for the. I don't even have enough to pity. I'll have to buy. You know how expensive these medals are. They're so expensive. I have to buy, which I really don't want to. If I don't actually pull her, we're starting with these summons right here. The rates for me to pull. Spectre Tenebria on this are 0.06%. But there is a chance. There is a chance. So we're gonna be starting with these to warm up. If you've never played Epic 7 and you like Grand Cross, you know, not my channel because of course Grand Cross. Listen, it's a good game. I think it's, um, it's fun, but don't be... <laughs> oh my... Okay. Uh, she's also one of the best units in the game. It's kind of pretty good that I got a dupe of her, but she's not Tenebria. Don't feel pre if you start playing this game, do not feel pressure to have every unit because getting every unit like in Grand Cross it can be achievable through the play, and it's not too bad ex expenses wise. In this game, God, man, the pressure you feel anytime you summon because the. <laughs> <laughs> so not very amazing, uh, but the game is fun, so I like it, and hopefully we'll keep up the streak of luck. We got a Ravi in the Moonlight Pools, which is nice. So, Spectre Tenebria, uh, you can see this is her real skin, this is how her normal character looks like. For it to look like how I want her to look like, which is that um, picture I showed, you actually have to pay 50 bucks. It's a, like a 50 box skin. Uh, okay, we actually pulled a... F we pulled a Moonlight character in this... No! No way! Now I shall force you into an eternal nightmare. <laughs> oh! Ah! Oh! No! We've only been pulling for three minutes and I already got her! This is why- No, this is not supposed to be so easy. I need to summon for at least eight minutes. No, I need to take a picture. And listen, this is a this is the type of thing that you send to your guildmates and be like, holy shit. One tap, baby. I don't know what you do now. That's all I ever wanted. I guess I'll summon on the other banner. Uh, I, I really want her too. Uh, no, I want her more. Yep, yep, this is... Goth, <laughs> I'll be pulling for two goth waifus in one video. Are you kidding me? In the first multi? Oh my god. See, this is what happens when you save and you don't buy summons enough to pity the character. You save your currency and you pull. And then you get the character you want and you feel good about yourself. Instead of giving Amazon all of your money, like the, like the pay pig you are. Whew. The amount of relief I have that I don't have to go in the shop crawling and say, Hey, please, I need more mystic medals, please. You have no idea. So I'll, I'll be uh, talking the same way I did in the Strays video. 
uh, for the anyone that's still watching, that you know watches me for Grand Cross and uh, does wonder, do I play other gacha games? A lot of people ask me, do you play Delcon? Do you play Legends? Currently, this is the only pl game I play, uh, gacha wise. Ooh, this might be, this might be it, because I actually felt like it has like a really nice gameplay loop um, with like the guild stuff and everything. Some stuff that I wish Grand Cross would implement. I think that the way to do guild battles in this game is really good. Oh, that's a great dupe. It's not the five star, but it's a character I've been wanting to build for a while. A real piece of shit, that character. Everyone hates her. Uh, <laughs> no. Those are the good characters. You know a character is good when everyone hates them. Uh, if I don't go to pity, if I waste, sorry, if I waste all my medals and I don't pull this character specifically that I'm pulling for, I'll... I won't like that, but I won't be too upset. I was really concerned <laughs> I would have to go to the shop and spend money for the other character. Tenebria. I will, because I'm going to buy the skin. That will be my uh, Amazon pay, pay pig moment. Because uh, this game actually buys stuff for the Amazon store. I wish Grand Cross had that. If you buy stuff on the Amazon store, it's discounted. So you don't, ha you don't have to pay full price. So it's not actually 50 bucks um, that I have to pay. It's like uh, oh, another Angel of Life, okay. It's like 37, I think, which is a great discount. Okay. All right, we didn't pull the second Goth Waifu. I, I am like three multis away from Pity. I'll get my free Mystic Medals from Guild Wars and uh, get her later. But we got what we came here to get. Let me actually put her on my inventory. So here is where you buy the skin and 110 of these materials again cost 50 bucks. Oh lord. Uh, it literally just, this gives me no advantage in the game whatsoever. And this is the one thing I'm happy to buy anytime. Skins because they give you no advantage. But this is the real reason why everyone likes her. You want to try me? So her voice lines are just absurd. <laughs> okay, I need to do like her ultimate. Not bad. And she would do like kiss a prop. Kiss my feet. Kiss my feet. I will step on you. Yeah. You know, Don't having having a character that's constantly saying something like this. Not bad. It's not good if you play with volume in public. You aren't even fit to kiss my feet. But you know. <laughs> you disgust me. If you're playing with the headset on, it's fine. You want to try me? So that's it. Honestly, you know, um, like like I said, this is the only other gacha game I play, and I don't make many videos on it. Strays' summoning was like over four months ago, and it's because I personally think that if you are someone that's just, you know, casually playing one of these games, you should not be spending that much money. I spend some money here and there because honestly, I like the game. But for example, if you if you do... If you're interested to start playing this game, this character is literally free. The skin isn't. But the character itself, one of, if not the best character in the game, literally free. And I was a stupid idiot that didn't get her when she uh, was essentially offered to me. So uh, that's about it. Again, if you play multiple gacha games, this is my advice. If you want, really want a character, wait, 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 and you get them eventually. Don't feel pressured.